Welcome back. I am Daniela and this is Art Around the World. Today we're doing part two of our crab. So hop on your apron and let's get started. Today's materials are tape, newspapers, a rag, two medium brushes and one hard brush or a toothbrush, a cup of water, and acrylic paint. We're gonna use cool colors and warm colors. For the cool colors, we have turquoise, another shade of turquoise, blue and dark blue. For the warm colors, we have orange, red, pink, and purple and we have a neutral color which is yellow and black. Feel free to use all the colors that you want. Step number one, we're gonna cover our table in case it gets dirty. Now that you have your materials, you have to bring your crab, the one that we made last class. Once your crab is set up, you're gonna start coloring the lower part, the belly of the crab, with the warm colors. I'm gonna use one brush and start the process. We're going to start with orange in the center. And we're going to blend some red around. To start with the relax. Our claws are gonna be purple and pink. We turn around our crab and we're gonna color the claws first purple and pink carefully coloring every white spot that we see and once we finish with our cloth we're gonna wash our brush dry it with your rag and you can use the other one for the top now we're gonna use all the cool colors for the top part of our crumb. We're gonna start with maybe dark blue. And then we're gonna add some lighter blue. Around. And maybe we're gonna continue with the turquoise. making sure that we cover every white spot. 
And now we're gonna go for the legs. The legs are gonna have the lighter turquoise or aqua. Remember to be gentle with your crab so it doesn't break. Next leg, I use maybe some blue too. We're gonna continue with the other side of our crab. We're gonna add some blue where we have different colors in our legs. Guys, this crab is looking awesome. Now that you have completed painting the legs and the carcass of the crab, we're gonna retouch the details. Maybe it needs a little more paint here and there and here. And you can use the light blue to just cover whatever needs to be covered. happy with the color of your crab, go ahead and wash your brush and you're gonna dry it on your bag. Maybe you clean your fingers too a little bit. Then you're gonna use your hard brush and dip it into the yellow paint. We're gonna color the eyes yellow. I am gonna color the eyes yellow, but feel free to use your favorite color. Then I'm gonna use the paint yellow and I'm gonna dip it and I'm gonna splatter all over the crab like this. Then we're gonna color the eyes of our friendly looking crab. And maybe why not a smile? And you guys have mastered and completed our Norwegian crab. Call your friends to join you in this project and learn how to make a paper mache crab. Goodbye guys, see you next time. Remember to subscribe so more kids can enjoy art around the world.